subscribe and download over 1 million code snippet including this tutorial from codegive.com, link in the description below. Title, Python User Input for Float, a comprehensive tutorial. Introduction User input is a crucial aspect of many Python programs, allowing users to interact with the application. When dealing with numerical data, it's often necessary to accept floating point values as input. This tutorial will guide you through the process of receiving and handling float user input in Python. In Python, you can use the input function to collect user input. However, by default, input returns the user input as a string. To handle float input, we need to convert the string to a float. When working with user input, it's crucial to handle potential errors gracefully. The float conversion can raise a value error if the input is not a valid float. We can use a try except block to catch such errors. To ensure that the user provides a valid float, you can use a loop until a valid input is received. This helps in preventing the program from crashing due to unexpected input. Adding clear instructions in the prompt helps users understand the expected input. This can reduce the chances of invalid input and improve the overall user experience. Handling user input for float values in Python involves using the input function and converting the input to a float using the float function. Additionally, implementing error handling and providing clear prompts enhances the robustness and user-friendliness of your program. ChatGPT